That winter blast, Ooh. cold temperatures stretching from Chicago down to Florida. And here in New York, major snow piling up near Watertown. Ginger is in Syracuse with the latest on that. Good morning, Ginger. It is cold. Oh, good morning, George. It's 27, but it feels like 13 in what looks like a picturesque downtown Syracuse. You say, oh, this is nice if you're just walking around until you get to the 8 to 12 inches of widespread snow. Some places 30 plus inches. Look at this. We're kicking off winter right, and it's not done yet. Winter is coming with a vengeance. Shocking cold, whipping winds, and whiteout conditions. More than two feet of snow and counting in parts of central New York. I went to bed and I woke up and it was winter wonderland. Slick roads and frigid temperatures in Ohio blamed for this 40 car pileup Sunday night. And this inferno in New Jersey sparked after high winds down power lines. A similar scene over the weekend in northern Michigan. Down power lines sparking a fire that engulfed two cars. That punishing winter weather. Oh, we got a out, man. Look at this. <laughs> pushing across the northeast. A gateway for the lake effect snow bands to set up right behind it. Got about four inches of snow. And as you can see, it's still coming down. Turning roads in New York into icy parking lots with traffic and us struggling to keep moving. We're still on Interstate 81 right in the heart of this lake effect snow band. We're actually in the lighter part. Long line of cars and still going about 25 on the highway. The hardest hit areas could get another six to even 12 inches. You guys, these roads are ridiculously bad. We were trying to get here last night. It felt just like when I was studying meteorology in Indiana. Strong lake effect bands, and they're going to keep going. Look at this lake effect snow advisories, wind advisories that go all the way down to Virginia. You can see where the heart of the lake effect snow and winter storm warnings are there. How much more on top of the 10 to 30 inches already on the ground? Another 6 to 12. And then we have to talk about the cold, because that is not just reserved for the Northeast. Already feeling this morning in Tallahassee, sub-freezing. So yes, it feels like a winter blast, not just there, but a lot of places, George. I'm getting blasted here downtown with I can, 20 I can, to 30 mile per hour gusts. I can tell, Ginger, the big question in everybody's mind this week, of course, packing up their cars for holiday travel, what's it going to mean? So the holiday travel, we got to get the forecast. That one storm digging in from the southwest is going to move in. I think if you're anywhere from Dallas up to the Midwest there, Minnesota, parts of Iowa, severe storms along the cold front in Dallas. Then on Wednesday, 5 a.m., if you're out of O'Hare, something to watch for sure, George.